In this video, I'm gonna show you how to get rid of that nasty glare in your glasses when shooting videos without compromising the lighting in your videos. And stick to the very end to figure out how you can get rid of that glare while shooting on your webcam. You gotta just press record. Hey, my name is Nolan Molt with Think Media and we're gonna get right into this video. So the reason you're getting a glare in your glasses is because like what I'm doing right now, you have the light right next to your camera. Now, when you do this, you typically can get away with really good lighting with just one light because this light is coming in and it's kind of filling in every part of my face. But you can't do this when wearing glasses if you don't want a glare. The first step is to move the lights away from the camera. So right now, I'm going to start to slowly move this away from the camera. You're going to notice that shadows are starting to appear on this side, but the glare is going away. Now, don't leave yet because we're actually gonna fix this lighting and kind of fill in these shadows with some more light. But what we've done here is we moved the light out of frame, but we didn't move it super far away. Just like with a microphone, you wanna keep it just out of frame. You wanna move the lights out until the glare is just out of the frames. You see what I did there? No, no Nobody's laughing. Now that the glare is moved just out of the glasses, I'm still looking at the camera. Obviously, if I go like this, you're going to see that glare, but this is perfect for the YouTubers or if you're doing an interview and you're looking straight ahead. So our second tip is to use soft lighting. The reason soft lighting is so important for people who wear glasses is because the shadows can come in really harsh when you don't have soft lighting. So, you know, adding a soft box, adding some diffusion is really gonna help get rid of those dark shadows on your face. If you wanna go in depth and learn how you can get soft lighting for as cheap as a dollar, you can actually click on this video where Tony and I went to the dollar store, we picked up some supplies, and we teach you how to get soft lighting. The third step for this lighting setup is to bring in a fill light. So as we turn on this fill light, you're gonna see these dark shadows are starting to be lifted up because of this light coming in on this side of my face. So we have our key light coming in here, we have our fill light, on this side and we just used an LED light that's bouncing up against a wall and that's gonna help bring in really soft lighting on this side of my face as well. Now there's a few more things that you need to know before lighting your videos with glasses, but first like this video and subscribe to Think Media and comment down below what kind of lights do you use for your YouTube videos. A couple tips to share with you guys that's gonna help you out a lot is to just think about where light is coming into the room. So when we set up this shot, Tony noticed that there was a mirror uh, behind the camera as well as a window that we're bringing glares onto my glasses. And so we removed the mirror, we closed the shades, and that got rid of those glares. Now when you bring in lights, you also just need to make sure that they are far enough on the side of the camera that they're not bringing on a glare. And then pairing that with soft lighting is really gonna take your lighting to the next level. Now we're gonna jump over to the computer and show you guys how to get rid of that glare while shooting on a webcam. So most of you have probably noticed that when shooting on the webcam, you obviously are gonna get a glare from the computer screen. So really the only way to get rid of that glare is if you turn the brightness all the way down on your screen. And then I'm gonna show you how to properly light it. So we're gonna start by turning the brightness down and you can see that that glare is going away. Now uh, in this camera, you can kind of see that it's hard for me to see the screen, but if you can maybe start with the brightness up and then uh, you know do some tests and then turn the brightness down to film, uh, it's gonna help with that glare. It's gonna get rid of the glare. But the lighting that I was using from this monitor is now gone, so I need to bring in another light. So if we back up here, I have this LED light that is pointing right at the back of my computer screen. Now, if your desk is off the wall, you can actually bring a light like this, maybe with a softbox, and place it right here pointing at you. But um, this is a perfect way to do it. When you bounce it at the wall, you're gonna get some nice soft lighting. So I'm gonna go ahead and just turn this all the way up and we're gonna see how that looks. So uh, I can see that it's a little bit too bright because this is just kind of auto exposuring. So I'm gonna turn it down just a little bit more. So this looks. All right, so now it's looking pretty good and I can turn up the brightness on my monitor to kind of check it. It looks great, I'm gonna turn that back down and I'm ready to shoot my video right into the webcam with no glares. If you wanna watch that soft lighting video that I talked about earlier, you can click or tap the screen right here. And until next time, I'll see you guys later.